Hi guys, thanks for tuning into the Scan Tool Network. In this video, it's a very short demonstration of the iCarsoft CR Max, uh, which is one of my favorite multi vehicle, multi system scan tools, actually. Um, it's available uh, at Diagnostic World, www.diagnostic world.com. I will put a link in the description below this video. Now, the reason it's important to get it from that website is because they will stock official, genuine products. There are fakes, there are clones on the market. Those fakes and clones, they can damage your vehicle, so it's really 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 important that you uh, don't take a risk and get one from a genuine outlet like Diagnostic World because you will be guaranteed to receive the genuine tool okay in any case uh, we're in an Audi Q5 right now we've got the traction control and the ABS warning light showing on the dashboard so we're going to use this tool to uh, hopefully diagnose those faults and find out what the problem is so we've got the tool plugged into the diagnostic port via this OBD2 cable here and we're going to click into diagnostics click into Audi which is our manufacturer. This takes a second to connect. Now you can either select your vehicle specifically or you can just choose it to uh, select it automatically. So you just select the down button, it will find the VIN number and you can OK that. And then you can either do set off like an automatic scan or you can just manually select the system in which you wish to diagnose. If you know which system you need to diagnose, then it's great because it's a lot quicker. So you go to, uh, in this case, we need to get the brake electronics, that's the ABS system in this vehicle, and we'll go to read fault code. So it's giving us two faults here, uh, 00287, electrical fault in circuit, rear right ABS wheel speed sensor, okay? That's semi what we expected, uh, 00473, electronic park and brake control module. So. From experience, I know that when you get an ABS sensor fault, it will also trigger some of the faults as well. In this case, it's triggered a fault with the electronic uh, parking brake. So we tend to know that the um, the main fault, which is the ABS sensor, can trigger other faults as well. So in this case, what we need to do is we need to put a new ABS sensor in, and that will then allow us to... The good news is that that part is only like £20, and it's, it's definitely a DIY job. Um, you could pay a garage to do that, but if you like to give things a go yourself, then I'd say an, an ABS sensor is definitely one of those jobs you can handle yourself. Um, but once you put a new ABS sensor in, then you can clear the codes and it will erase this code and it will erase that code as well. And obviously, not only that, it will erase all of these warning lights on the dashboard there, which are relating to that. Um, but that is, in a nutshell, the iCarsoft CR Max. It will do that for all vehicles and all systems. Not only that, though, but it will do service functions as well. So all of these service functions on your vehicle, you know, if you need to do calibrations or uh, adaptions or battery registrations, DPF regenerations, it'll allow you to do... Um, like actuation tests, um, component testing, but it's a bi-directional tool so it allow you to do all of that as well. Uh, but as I mentioned though, if you are interested, make sure to use the link in the description below this video. It will take you to Diagnostic World where you'll find the genuine and official product. Thanks for watching, I'll see you on the next video.